Good afternoon, everybody. This is the daily video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. My name is the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. Today is Monday, April 27th, 2020. It's the start of a new week. One of the um, stranger parts of ministry in 2020 is that I basically work a nine to five Monday through Friday job now, or at least closer than I have in years. We record the service for Sunday on Friday afternoon. And so the good news is having weekends with my family is great. Uh, we've, we've really been enjoying those. And uh, for the first time in years, um, Monday is a thing as the weekend ends. But it is a time to turn to what is ahead for the next couple days. And one of the big pieces that I'm working on right now and for the rest of the week is my annual report to the congregation. We are a democratic tradition, and so twice a year our congregation gathers as a deliberative body to elect officers, pass a congregational budget, and to hear about the state of our community. And I'm struck in, in writing this thing this year, just how little the year ended up being about the things that we started with. We did an enormous amount of work in the beginning of the congregational year, gearing up to change big pieces of congregational life. And then we did, and then we ended up changing it again, almost from the ground up two months later. So as a preview of the report you'll hear me give at the spring meeting, there are two things that are constant in church life. Change, always change every year, and the underlying truths that endure. Theodore Parker, the 19th century Unitarian minister, called these the, the transient and the permanent, because everything changes. That is the nature of being alive, and that is the nature of being an institution. And yet, for those of us who are faithful people, the institution and the truths that it is built on endures. And that's the role that we have as leaders, to manage change as it happens, to respond to events as they happen in the world, and to make sure that there will be a Unitarian Church of Lincoln for many generations to come. What endures and what changes? the transient and the permanent. It's a tension in our faith, and it's one that feels very, pre very present this week. Both things are important, and both things are very, very present right now. So have a great night, and I will see you tomorrow.